Hey everyone, today I'm sharing 10 all new home hacks. You guys already know that the lids on these are super cool, but did you know that the lid on a Parmesan container will fit onto a mason jar? When I found this out, I was blown away. So you can put sugar or any items in here, transfer your lid to your mason jar, and then you can just keep this in your pantry and then sprinkle out a little bit when you need it. So I have a DIY hack for you guys. If you're hanging a picture on the wall, you know sometimes you have to like put your hammer down and like fish around for your nails. Well, here's a little hack to make sure you always have your nails with your hammer. So you're gonna get a circular magnet. I'll link to the ones down in the description box that I'm using, and I'm going to hot glue it to the bottom of my hammer. going to add some nails to the bottom of this magnet. Now when I go to hang something on the wall, I can have my hammer in one hand and just pull a nail off. You guys are going to love this next hack. So how many times have you pulled out your aluminum foil and this piece just comes out and it's just a mess and everything's all over the place? Well, I saw this hack on TikTok and I think it's pretty genius. So did you know that on the side of your aluminum foil, there's these little circles here that you can press in. So you just pop them in like this and it's going to hold your aluminum foil in place. You can do it on that side and then you do it on this side as well. So just pop that in. Now, anytime you wanna pull out your aluminum foil, it's gonna stay in place. How genius is that? Let me know in the comments if you guys knew about this hack. So I'm gonna show you guys a simple vase hack using a toothbrush holder. You can buy these at Dollar Tree. You can also pick them up at the thrift store. I thought this one was really cute, so we're gonna use it for this hack. The cool thing about a toothbrush holder is it has holes to put in your stems. So I have these stems that I picked up from Walmart. You can use anything for this. And you're just gonna use the holes in the toothbrush holder to place in your stems. This is going to keep them upright and also nice and divided. You can put all your stems in there and then go back in and fluff them out so they make a nice arrangement. I think this is one of the coolest hacks I've seen in a while. If you guys like seeing home hack videos, make sure to hit that thumbs up button so I know to do more like it in the future. This next hack involves denture cleaners. So I buy a lot of glassware at the thrift store and it gets really dirty. Here's a simple way that you can clean your glassware and shine it up really pretty to use. This also works really well if you have glassware that has stains on it. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna fill up your containers with water. So I'm gonna put in warm water. Now these were containers I recently picked up at the thrift store and they just need to be cleaned out. Then you're gonna take a denture cleaning tablet and you're gonna drop it into the glass. We're gonna let that soak for like three to five minutes and come back and see how well they're cleaned out. So the cleaner's been dissolving for about five minutes now, so I'm gonna rinse it out with a little bit of water. Then I'll use a microfiber towel to dry it and I'll show you how good they look. great. They are sparkling. They are clean. Let me know in the comments if you guys have used denture cleaner to clean or remove stains from anything. I think they would be great for wine glasses or different glassware that's got stains on it. 
Now, if you're new to following me, you may not be aware that I actually go live on Amazon weekly. I share some of my favorite Amazon products and fashion, beauty, like Amazon gadgets, DIY organization. So if you click the link down in the description box, it'll take you to my Amazon lives. And if you just hit that little X button to follow me, you'll get notified anytime that I go live. I wanted to show you guys a few of the items that I found on Amazon that make my life so much easier. Now, the first one is this product called Bagnet. I recently found this and this thing is so cool. This is a multifunctional bag hanger. It holds up to eight pounds. It fits onto your purse. It has this little opening here so you can slide it onto your purse. It has a really strong magnet in here so you can put it on bar stools, you can put it on your fridge, basically anything that's magnetic so that when you're out, you don't have to place your bag on the floor. I love this invention and my bag is full of stuff and it held it up perfectly. This is also great when you're at the gym or in restrooms or sporting events or anywhere where you just don't want your bag sitting on the floor. You can just keep this on your bag. You never know when you're gonna be in those situations where you need to use something like this. Another product that I found on Amazon, if you have a stove like I do that has an upper portion like this, I found this stove shelf that is magnetic and it fits right on top of my stove. This shelf is great because it actually gives me another surface where I can put spices, I can put my little timer, really anything that I need to set up there while I'm cooking. So love organization hacks that give me more space. I don't know about you guys, but it takes me forever to go through a bag of lemons. So if I buy them at the store and I want them to last for months, I don't wanna store them like this. Let me show you the hack for how you should be storing your lemons in the fridge. So grab a jar that has a lid. This one is pretty inexpensive from Ikea. And then all you're gonna do is place your lemons inside. Next, you're just going to fill it with water up until all the lemons are covered. Now you can just store your lemons like this in the fridge and they'll last for months. If in your house or your kid's room, you have an excess amount of stuffed animals, pillows, blankets, and you need somewhere to store them, that's actually functional. I found this hack and it's a bean bag hack. So I picked up this large bean bag off of Amazon that you can just fill up with things you have around your house. So I'm gonna show you how you can fill it up with pillows, but if your kids have a ton of stuffed animals, you can put those in here as well. We would do this until we couldn't do it. Each and every house. literally fit every single pillow in my living room and blanket. So I'm just gonna zip it up. So I'm gonna flip it back here. Now you have a fun beanbag chair that you can sit in. This would be perfect for your kids room, basement, and you're storing all that stuff that was just sitting out or maybe in a drawer taking up a lot of room. If you love seeing home hack videos, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I post new videos on Mondays and Thursdays, so just hit that little red subscribe button. If you guys have kids or grandkids who are obsessed with poppets like my kids are, here is a really fun snack you have to try for them. So what you're gonna need is a poppet. You're also going to need some blueberries or any other fruit, but blueberries will probably work the best, and then any kind of yogurt that you wanna use. So I'm gonna start by putting the blueberries in each of the poppet holes. Make sure that you have them popped all down the same way. Next, you're gonna take your yogurt and just spread it across the top. Now I'm just going to take this, pop it in the freezer until it sets up and it's completely frozen. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have any home hacks you'd like me to try in an upcoming video and I'll talk to you in our next one. Bye.